Off to the Western Buckeye League now, the Kent Wildcats, part of that log jam that's second in the league behind St. Mary's. Off to a much better start than their 2017 campaign, but they were victorious over the Van Wert Cougars last year, and they don't want that to change as Robinson Field, the host of this matchup tonight. Kenton filling in the stands. Van Wert tied with the Cats at 13 in the second quarter. Pick it up with Van Wert's Nate Place keeping it here for a big pickup, and what a big year he has had. Coops coming off that Shutout win over Shawnee last week. And it's place finding Drew Bagley over the middle. Another first down for the Cougars. Place keeps it himself, and he is trucking into the end zone. Look at this run. Nice little slide step and score. Van Wert goes in front, 19 to 13. Kenton looking to answer with their standout signal caller, Jaron Sharp, finding Jaden Cornell. Big pickup here inside the 40, dances in across midfield for a big first down. Then it's Sharp lobbing it to land and rush. Tanner Barnett is there. Looks like he gets the pick, but the refs rule down. Barnett picks up a flag. That sets Kenton up. So Sharp taking advantage, finds Rush over the middle, and he gets across the goal line for the score, tying it up. But Van Wert. They get the victory tonight. Take a look at the final, 60 to 33. So Kenton allows 70 points at St. Mary's and then 60 to the Cougars. How about the win for Van Wert? They're putting themselves in good position for a postseason burst.